When we do ratios, you can tell it's a ratio because it's got the colon in the center of it. And remember that we need to compare the parts to the total. So I know that they're red and white. So there's two parts red to one part white. And remember, if you add them together, you get the total number of parts. So in this case, 2 plus 1 gives us 3. Now it tells us there are a total of 30 marbles in the bag. So I'm going to put that underneath on the total column. How many red marbles are there? So I'm going to look at the pair that I've got here. To go from 3 to 30, it's going to be multiplying because it's getting bigger. And I need to think multiplying by what? 3 times what gives us 30? Well, in this case, it's going to be times 10. So I can use that rule the whole way down. So that means 20 red, 10 white. Since it asks specifically how many red marbles there are, it would be 20 because red came first. So let's do another example of that. It's another one. We're still going to compare parts to whole. Three green, seven pink, two yellow. And so it even gives it to you three parts, seven parts, and two parts. And remember, add those all together to get your total. So three plus seven plus two gives us a total of 12 parts. Now, look at this. You know that there are 21 green jelly beans. Well, 21 green jelly beans, the first one is my green ones. So I'm going to put a 21 down here underneath the green part, right? Green, pink, yellow. So make sure that you line things up where it was. In this one, it gave us a total of 30, so I put it in the total column. Here, a 21 green, so I need to put it in the green column. So same idea. The one that you have a pair of, you need to think, what is your scale factor? We're getting bigger, so it's multiplying. If you're getting smaller, it's dividing. 3 times what gives us 21? Well, this is times 7. So we're going to multiply everything by 7. 7 times 7 gives us 49. 2 times 7 gives us 14. 5 times 7, I need a calculator for that one, gives us 84. So now when it asks us how many jelly beans are there in total, it's going to be 84. 